Stitchy friends. Hi everybody. Today's February 23rd, 2020. I'm Laura. I'm Brenda. And away we go with yes. another fun-filled episode, yes. I hope. Yes. We're kind of um, a little all over the place, but we've got a lot to share and we're going to get right to it. So yeah. Um, since we filmed last, it's been two weeks. Mm -hmm. So I know you have some exciting things. Yeah. But I'm going to open up my book here okay. because... I just love it that you fill it in all day. Woo -woo. Yes. Good for oh, you. remember how this month I was going to be so focused on three things with Michelle, and I was for one day. This, I mean, really, it's. Uh, I'm. You have to go with what makes you happy. I know, right? but so I mean, I have to no, or that. I'm not going to stress, so to yes. speak. But mm, it's just I mean, the way I you am, roll. Yeah, just the way I roll. Yeah. So, in no particular order, when I went home last week, I finished. <gasps> Yes, My Sister's Garden by Lottie Da. So beautiful. Yeah. So beautiful. Yeah. So I'm uh, so happy you fun. finished that. Yeah, me too. I love it. I yeah. really love it. And good sense of accomplishment. Yes. So that very was nice. the first thing I did. Very, very nice. And then I finished this old one, Bloomin' Alphabets. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. And... Yeah, it's really pretty. Mm -hmm. It's it's really different, I think. I love it. It's an older one of hers, yeah, too. Yeah, it's so. old. And then I finished Yellow Bird, but I made him blue. I used Blue Mare by Belle Soir and 40 Count Newcastle Sand. Well, I guess 40 Count Newcastle is redundant, isn't it? <laughs> It's beautiful, Laura. Yeah, that blue is I beautiful. really like it. Yes. And this sand looks kind of yellowy, so mm -hmm. I kind of consider it, you know, just all goes together pretty yes. well. Very, very nice. So I, you know, I started those, so I Three finished those. Finishes. I know, it's shocking. Yes. And then I went all over the place. Let's see what's in my Christie bag. That's one of my favorite. Oh, things. this is the Lady in Red Spinning Wool. Actually, the day that I went home uh, from last one, I last floss tube I finished that this flower here so beautiful and then I thought oh beautiful. I better start working on my Lottie Dawes so I did good and then let's see what's here oh that's okay <laughs> then I got out my seven sheep sampler oh Oh, and well, I actually, didn't. I didn't get it out. I had started it on 32, okay. and then I decided I didn't want to do it on 32 anymore. This is by the Scarlet House. It's one of the most classic, wonderful samplers in the world. Mm -hmm. So, and I'm doing it with the cottons on 40 count vintage sand dune by Lakeside. Oh, those are pretty boots. Yeah, they're not. They haven't been to cold yet. Yeah. Um, and I started in the middle. Oh, okay. I don't know I was why. Gonna say it. Got it. Okay, but I did. Okay. Well, you can do some fun stuff. Yeah, because I think the border can get. Yeah, it was with any border it gets tedious, right? Tedious. Yeah. Oh, I wanted to mention this thing. Was this whose idea was? Panyas. Okay, I thought so. At Target, you can get these letter baskets, and then you take it home and you get out some scrapbook paper and some ephemera, and you put it in here like this and then when you're stitching you put all your stuff in it and set it by your side and drive your husband crazy when you drop stuff <laughs> um and it's all right there yeah convenient. and then I just keep yeah. I'm keeping everything in here very nice yeah one time we went crazy over those yes we did <laughs> yes we did with good reason yes. too yes I have several of them downstairs I never put any um decoupage and all that stuff on them but um, we had fun yeah and then oh okay I did have one one haul thing which was oof, in the garden of holland by modern folk embroidery now did you download this as a pdf okay yeah. you can i did download it as a pdf and i had this paper okay it's wonderful yeah that's um, really you can nice. tell how much I love this because I downloaded it as a PDF because usually I want it like in the bag and pristine yes. and whatever, but I was like, uh, but yeah, you I printed need it, it just like it would be kind of, I oh. mean, this is awesome. 
Yeah, that's beautiful. So I started in the middle because I wanted to start the lady in the middle. So there she is. Oh, that's pretty, Laura. Yeah. And this is on 40 count American chestnut by R and R, which I am in love with. That's a beautiful. I need color. to yep. see if Ann and Pat have more of that. And let's see. I'm colors. using the DMCs. Oh, and you're using. Oh, okay. First of all, I have to say, I hope you're. I hope you're not mad that I use these I things know. that you gave me. No, 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 no. Okay, because they're the Brenda brought these for those photos to put on. But I was like, oh, these, are, I, I want to make, <laughs> yeah, use them. So this is the DMC. Those are pretty. Here, yeah. show it with that. Oh, okay. I'll hold it. Ooh, oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. So I'm very hepped about this. Very nice. Yeah. You've done, and you got a good amount done. Yeah, I got that middle yeah. uh, motif done. Beautiful. Okay. And I love his stuff. Oh, I mean, no, all of it's so classic yeah. and just beautiful. Yeah. So, and I also had one more start that I threw in there, but I think you started it too. Yep. So, we've had it for a while, this chart and everything that goes with it. Mm -hmm. However, on Instagram this week, we saw Faye Rigsby start on it. And then both of us were like, oh, pulling that out. Yes. I mean, Faye's pictures are just amazing they are beautiful i just want to drop everything and work on it but it's exclusive to sassy jack's sample yes. yes let's let's see oh i think you got a little further than moi it's on uh, legacy linen something or other yeah. with Close. silks yeah with the overa soie oh which i decided yes that's my favorite silk now really yes why i just i don't know the feel of it I don't know. Okay. I just decided that. That's it does work really, really well on the um this legacy. Um because this yeah. Oh look at us. Yeah. That's look cute. It. <laughs> I love it. I love it. My only issue, and it's not an issue really, is that the fabric is really stiff. And it will loosen up over time, but yeah. when you're stitching with it, well, are you using a hoop? Yes, and that's it's just me. It'll loosen yeah. up, and I know that. It's just I think the sizing in it, and someone mm. can correct me if I'm wrong. Well, you're but, just used really used to like lakeside and R and R. Yeah, that kind of drape. Yeah, and this is more. It's a stiff, but it's yeah. beautiful. And after seeing Faye's updated picture, like the last couple of days, yeah. she got down to the house and oh, it's yeah. just, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. So, and when you get the fabric from Sassy Jacks, they um, surge it, surge it. And when you get it from Kathy at Inspired Needle, she does the same thing. I just think that's a great extra touch. I love surged. Um, I don't have a surge. Elena loves surge. That's her boyfriend's name. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's cute. Okay. Oh, one. And this is in my oh. Becky. This is in my Isabella Fox bag. Oops. I know. <laughs> oops. But there it is. That's and beautiful. the little, I'll show it while I've got this out here. The little um, floss thing. I got. Oh. I got a lot of haul this week. Since we Someone had video. to. Yeah. <laughs> this is from LaDonna. And this is one of her Valentine ones that love is patient, love is kind. Just really nice. So I put that on there. Anyhow, that's cool. I'll just show that now while it's all there. I'm going to show okay. something now, too. I got that's this so a couple sweet. of months ago. It's a, a linen towel, you know, his, hers. But this one is hers, Terry, from the Old Needle Shop on Etsy. She does finishing, and she oftentimes has fun little things to buy. And I just couldn't resist this because, yeah. you know, in my quest that I'm going to have a bowl full of pin cushions, this will be in it. Yes, that's beautiful. So this is like a vintage towel that she yes. finished. Okay. That she, you know, Got cut it. and then made into. That's a great this idea. beauty. Yes. So it Which, be enjoyed. Ooh, that could start a whole other thing, going out and buying vintage towels. Yeah. <gasps> You know, I have to learn how to sew, but you know, well, you could send it to somebody coming. who could sew. Oh, yeah, 10 4. Or your mom. Yeah. Terry at the Old Needle Shop. Thank you. She has an Etsy shop, the Old Needle Shop. And yep. you can order from stuff from her. It's very nice. Very, very nice. Very nice. 
Okay. okay. I need, I've only had one tab yet today. Okay, so pop a tab. Whoosh. I am not caffeinated properly yet. I am. Oh, you are? I've been up. Yes. I've had two or three. I shouldn't say that. I've had two sodas this morning. Oh, Diet Dr. Pepper. Yes. Okay. Last we mentioned, I put Sarah in timeout. Sarah Stewart Hardeman. Because I was struggling with the over one. And a friend who had seen my video, Mary, sent me a message and said, why don't you use Tudor Silk for the over one? Because Tudor Silk is finer. It's a Gloriana, which is what this calls for. And it will be, it might be easier. So I thought, what a genius idea. So I have some Tudor Silks. So I went down to my stash and I pulled it out and I replaced the Tudor Silks that I had with some of the over one. But I powered through. Mm, good job. And we have the people completed, all that over one in his face, wow. in her arms and everything. I did another sheep right there. It's not surrounded by grass. And this morning, I did another one over here. Another little over one. So I have three over one sheep left and I'm done. Wow. I have no problem doing over one on 40 or 46, like in a verse or what have you. I think my struggle was because this is totally filled in and just seeing it was really hard uh, for me, but I didn't want to abandon this project no. and I'm hoping for a finish before market. I have the house left to fill, the grass and the border. And I will work on this only until it gets done, just because I want it done. I want it done, and I want it framed. And you I'm know what? Wife. What? I, sh I should have probably maybe told you about that Tudor Silk thing, because one time I was having a hern about that, and um, Carolyn at the attic said, get a beading needle, mm -hmm. size 10, I think. Yeah. And Tudor Silk for okay. over one. I, it was a great idea, and I used it. Did it make a difference? Yes, it did. I didn't have all the colors I needed, so I used it where you could. for the colors I could, mm -hmm. and I just did it in early in the morning. Mm -hmm. um, and yesterday I did that whole man's all that over one, and this morning I did that sheet, no problem whatsoever. Mm. So um, I am. This will be a finish by the time we are together next time. Okay. I hope. Ooh. I hope. I hope so, too. But in the meantime, when I had put that in timeout for a couple of days, I started that Middle Mist mm -hmm. sampler. Mm -hmm. And then I also started this one. And this is Miss Manners. I think we talked about that a little bit. Miss Manners by GGR. Love. Uh, I love it. Carolyn has stitched it. Um... I don't think she's finished it, but there's someone else who has finished it, and it's beautiful. Um, Carol Saltbox Stitcher started it, and is here, that the attic conversion? This is the attic silk conversion. These are the colors. I mean, the red. There's red in here. I mean, who doesn't love that? And I am using pecan butter, mm. 40 count lakeside Ooh. pecan butter. Ooh. I didn't get very far. Just that. Oh, that's. Beautiful. Not beautiful. The colors are great. I just put that the Sarah way. This was a nice, easy, you know, you to work on. easy. Yes. Yes. So, because I will talk about in a little bit a project I abandoned and never went back to. So, anyhow, those that was my last two weeks, but so kind of boring. Not really. But no. I'm happy with Sarah. And this is a bag, this bag, I bought at the attic last year when we were there in November. Isn't that classy? Yeah. And on the inside, oh, I should have left it. It has I don't want to give away the big reveal by saying what's on the inside. There we go. Some Blackbird. Because <laughs> it was so perfect. We were there for the Blackbird retreat and Jean had these for sale. I mean, that's beautiful. Love, love. Very that. beautiful. Yes. yes. So that's that. I'll put that away later. Okay. So that's been my two weeks of stitching. Um. Yeah. 
we got a card. <laughs> we got a card. Yeah. Uh, Denise from Dot Dot Goose Designs sent us bags. Aren't those beautiful? These are her spring bags. Yes. Which she's doing a new spring bag every week until March 21st. Those are beautiful. Yeah, I really love these. I have one of hers nice. at awesome. home, too. Or maybe it's with me. I don't know. But thank you, Denise. Yes, thank you very, very much. Very much. Yeah. So, and she's on Etsy. And here... Dot, dot, goose designs. Yep. And she's got a cute cat, Miss Gracie. Yes. Very nice. That was a cute, very nice little card. Very nice. So yeah. Thank you very much. Woohoo, kitty. <laughs> then we also got some charts that are coming out at market. This is from Wendy, Needle Art by Wendy. These are some of her new releases. Um, this is called what? Bloom and Spring? Or no, Summer Bloom. Sorry, Summer Blooms. Not cute. And this one is Spring Begins. And this one is going to be a little series. This is part one. Sampler Petites. Yeah. yeah. Sampler Petite. Cute. Just a little, when I got these, I thought, oh, these are really cute for spring. And when my girls were younger and they had spring break, I was working tax season. Mm. Blah. Anyhow, I always wanted to start a spring break project. Just something fun to work on in the evenings when they were on spring break. Don't ask me what the correlation is other than I always chose a project for spring break and it was always an easy one. A lot of them were the Lizzo, the older Lizzie Cates, like uh, Live Simply, Laugh Off, and Love Deeply was one I did. Mm -hmm. Just different ones. And these are reminding me yeah. of those to a spring break project because you cool. could easily finish them in less than a week and they're just nice and fun to do and so anyways look for those at market maybe it'll be your spring break project mm -hmm. so yeah. some people are talking about uh, a leap year day project start oh yeah i saw that i don't need any excuses yeah next saturday mm -hmm. oh yeah mm -hmm. i didn't even think about that so. mm -hmm. um haul yeah did you get any haul all i got was that pdf from modern folk embroidery oh. i know well I made up for it. <laughs> I made up. Thank goodness. Somebody. Somebody boosting the economy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right? Okay, so yesterday, let's start with what arrived yesterday. This is the new, uh, and if you're in the Berry Club, don't look. Don't look right now. So close your eyes. This is the new Berry Club from Dying to Stitch. This is awesome. And I can't emphasize enough how great it is to get something in the mail very 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 affordable it comes with absolutely everything you need all the ch finishing the instructions everything and it's very reasonably priced i don't know if the clubs have closed do you know i think they have oh, okay well get on there be for on next standby year. for next yes. year yes so i got that and then i got this oh boy this is by blackbird designs all joys for thine and Nicole had a video out, and I watched it this morning, her latest one, and she started this. And you need to start it now. It's beautiful. The colors are very muted, blackbird colors. I love it. I just love it. Are you going to do it on the call for uh, fabric? Yep. Which is Heartland? Yep. 36 count Heartland. Are you going to do it on 36? Uh-huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're just going to, wow. Following yeah. all the rules. Yeah. Again, I won't start until I finish Sarah, but right. I'm very tempted. There's two things I'm very tempted to start this week. This, this is one of them, and I'll get to the other one. Okay. I just love that. You, you got to pull the trigger on this, I, man. I, I was, it's a Blackbird. Yeah. I was telling Brenda that I haven't pre-ordered anything from Market yet because I'm so overwhelmed by, like, there's so many things that are, like, amazing yeah. that I just sat down in my chair and said I better just sit down here for a minute because you have to make a list of what yeah you, what you need right now and yeah. then spread it out through the year correct mm -hmm. yeah and what then I like to spread it out through like inspired needle right dying to yeah. stitch my friend Julie at Gulf Coast stitches okay yeah yeah all over 
Okay, and then I got oh this. This is a wool applique book from Lisa Bonjean. Um, Lisa, Kindred Stitcher, showed this on her latest video. So I paused the video, <laughs> went and ordered it. I love wool applique, and I have a ton of it. I have done some. This is just a great beginner book with oh. some great patterns in here. And oh, I just love it. That's fun. So it's just fun to get and to look through. And she gives you some great tips. If you don't follow Lisa, Bon Primitive Gatherings is her company. And you like wool applique, you need to do that. It's fun. It's different. It's easy. You don't need, I don't need a magnifier. I can do it anywhere. So, because cross stitch, you got to have your whole setup, your light, your magnifier, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Then I got my, this kit from Country Sampler. This is the last of the ABC Club, but they are continuing it. So, you can probably sign up for it if you want to get in for next year. So. Oh boy. Then I got, what happened to my, oh yeah. Oh, okay. These are good too. I know. I'm telling you, real good. Work's been rough. And when work is rough, therapy. <laughs> Retail therapy at its best. So Becky, Socks for Mom, had a video and she showed her sampler girls and I ordered these thread keeps. This is the first. Don't ask me their names. I don't know. This is the first one. And it comes with a little scissor on the back. Then this one. Oh, I love her. And, whoops. This one. I can't pick a favorite. And, there we go. And then... This one is with um, on, with brass, and mm. I kind of like that. I think this beautiful. was another instance where I loved every single one so much that I couldn't eat. I just, just get them all. I didn't get them all, but I got a good portion of them. Yeah. I just yeah, love these. These are just amazing. And when Did you, you watch uh, Michelle Rudy's tutorial on making no, these? Well, I no. just did, and... Oh boy, that could be a rabbit hole. Yeah. Michelle Rudy is so talented. I, I mean, the, the her life for one thing. <laughs> and then her creativeness with stitching and wool applique and knitting and quilting and, and then paper these and, and retreats. I mean, sheesh. It makes me She's incredible. a Wonder Woman. Yes. Anyways, when you get these from Becky, she put every one in one of these little oh, bags. That was so, sweet. Yeah. I just thought that was very nice. Oh my God, so I got those. Pull the trigger there. Yeah. Okay. Then I got, I showed you the one I got from LaDonna. This is Sampling of Memories. This is the little bunny. I just think that's cute. Then I had sent some fabric to Belinda, Blue Ribbon Designs. Are you going to pop that? Oh, I popped that. Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay, sweet. I'm just standing by oh. for this, this <laughs> area show that I'm in lust with. These, oh. this is some fabric. I don't even remember where I got it. I don't know if I got this at Ship Shawana or at um, Peaceful Gatherings in Fox River Grove. Do you know who makes it even? I'm not even sure. But Belinda, I mean, look at that. Those gorgeous bags are just, and then here's another one. This is just a different colorway, same birds. Oh, look at her little blue yes. ribbon design girl. I know. Oh, I got to get a package in the yeah. mail. Yes, and then this is another one. This is bigger. This is the bigger regular size, size project yeah. bag. The other two were smaller. Then I got these panels from Brenda. Gervais with thy needle and thread and she made them with her with the bottom flat bottom so they're like bigger and the little strawberry here and this one kit it up yep that's your I saying mean, <laughs> that's I just love these little bags I and Belinda's those. work is just perfect 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 so I got that back it doesn't stop there, folks. Really? No. Oh, yeah. Let's keep going. I know. <laughs> it's all good. All good. Yeah, it is all good. Then I got this back 
from Total Frame. This is the LW sampler that I stitched along with Carol Saltbox Stitcher. This is by Samplers Not Forgotten. I stitched it on 40 count. I can't remember the fabric. The only change I made is this alphabet in here is with Mountain Mist. It called for Lexington Green. And I wanted that, fab, that alphabet to stand out. This is from Total Framing and they did a beautiful job. Beautiful, beautiful job. I've had questions about it. Um, you can contact Total Framing first and you should before you send them your pictures and I send them all via FedEx and they get them, they pick out frames, we cost, they go over everything so that you're not spending it's pretty seamless and yes. they work with you. Yes. And then it comes back via UPS um, with tracking and you get it I get it because I'm in Illinois within two days. And I've never had a problem with glass. I always have glass on mine. And mm -hmm. they pack it so tight, it takes you <laughs> more than a minute to get the thing open. So, anyhow. I love it. Yeah, love it's it. gorgeous. Love Do you know where you're going to put it? Yes. It's oh. already hanging. I had oh, to get okay. it down. So, wow. Yes. Yeah. Cool. I have the, if you're going to complete a sampler, get it on the wall. And get it framed, get it on the wall. Because you've put all that time into it. Don't let it languish in a drawer. So, anyhow. But, if you don't want to finish the sampler for whatever reason, and I loved these samplers, and but I was not going to finish them because of personal um, issues that I had with them. It was the designs are beautiful. The samplers are beautiful. But I knew I was never going to finish them. So, I sent them to Joy at Finally Finished. Um, and she worked her magic and magic is the word. This is the Smith sampler by the Scarlet House. This is my unfinished Smith sampler. And you, as you can see, I had more than three quarters done and I was not going to finish it. And it's a beautiful, beautiful sampler. Um, and Joy turned it into a needle roll. So it folds up like that. This is on the front side or the back side, however you want to look at it. Oops, let's turn it the right way oh, like wow. that. And then on the inside, here it is on the inside. Joy added the pin cushion and it's got some weight in it. I think she put either sawdust or, um, what do you call it? Walnut crystals, walnut shells, not crystals. She put the little floss, you can put little floss in here. And then these little pockets, and she put some vintage <laughs> trim. I mean, and this is silk ribbon to oh tie it up God. with. That's amazing. So now it sits on my stitching chair, next to my st stitching chair downstairs like that. So I get to enjoy it, and it's so much better than for me that it's way. It's beautiful. So. Absolutely beautiful. Joy's work is beautiful. Then remember I finished, or I had started Jane Stanwick's, didn't like my uh, fabric, I liked yours so much better, mm -hmm. so much better. So what I had done, I sent it to Joy, and she made this drum. This is the top part. And see that little strawberry? That is a motif that I had stitched, and she cut it out and made a strawberry on top. It's a short drum, it's only about maybe three and a half, four inches high. <gasps> well, I hope you saw it because it's on the floor over there. And we're stuck. No. We, we can't move. No. Yes. <laughs> oh. It's a beautiful day here today. I don't have, it's not enough to open the windows, but it's um, wonderful here today. So. Yeah. Then I had finished this a long time ago, a few months ago, and I saw Terry chocolates for breakfast chocolates the number four breakfast on instagram and she had finished hers and she wound hers on a child size rolling pin which what? is what this is so i thought well that's i mean that's Genius. the bee's knees right yeah. so i went to where you go to get all your vintage stuff ebay oh really yeah i found it on ebay 
they had some that were painted, um, you know, like red or green, and those were cute. And I think hers was uh, painted with red. And I just got a plain one, very affordable. It came, and I just wrapped this around. I'm not going to be able to do it because I'm all thumbs right now, but <laughs> just wrap it around and tie it up oh. and then I have it displayed in my stitching room. Oh. I mean Terry is she's so creative she's done so many things you really if you're on Instagram follow her because she's just got so many great ideas so I took that inspiration from her just love it love 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 it well that gets my stomach in a jumble that's yeah. all of I, that stuff I mean is, is that not cool yeah you could do one of those band, um, little bandings, and mm -hmm. put it on here. It'd have to be the one that's over one, and even then, I don't know if it'd fit, but it's just a great idea. eBay's going to look at their el algorithm <laughs> and go, child's rolling pins are trending. Why? Yeah. <laughs> and now, they, and it's very, very affordable, less than $20, so it's so great. Cute. And it's great. Oh, so that's it. That's all I got for you today. <laughs> Finishes. Yeah, that's stash. some good stuff. Yeah. And as tax season rolls around, we could have more retail therapy, and especially with market coming. Oh my. Which I've I have ordered two designers mm -hmm. all of their charts. Okay, do um, tell. Brenda Gervais. Mm -hmm. I loved every yeah. single one of her I designs. would give a thumbs up to every single one of those and the way she showcased them on Instagram with the music and displaying them that was fun that was you know what genius Friday at work it was slow <laughs> did you make no, it, it was slow Thursday. or was it really slow no, it was Thursday oh. anyway I called in my friend Stephanie you know Stephanie at work who like is interested in the stuff even though she doesn't do it I like showed her all those reveals oh, on okay. Instagram yeah. of Brenda's and it was really fun just to see somebody else's reaction. And she has to have coffee every morning, so I maybe need to stitch oh, that, that coffee, coffee first. first. Yes. For her. yes. And, yeah, there's one of hers that are, and I don't remember the name, but it's a sampler. And Is it the big, the main sampler? I yes. love that. It's beautiful. Yeah. And then I ordered all of Tanya's. Of course. The we Scarlet will be doing House. that. Yes. And the one that is my absolute oh, well, favorite. Oh, it's the same. It is. It's is it the one like when it comes out? I'm getting everything yes. and I'm starting it. Yes, Charlotte Frost. Yes, yes. yeah, yeah. That's mm -hmm. just. I mean, Tanya has just the way with picking the right sampler, and her work is amazing. And yeah. so those are the two I've ordered. Everything. Mm -hmm. I have seen quite a bit, but I have to. Reel it in, Brenda. Mm. Reel it in. <laughs> so. I saw a lot of things from Beth Twist, Heartstring Samplery yes. that I want. Yes. Um, yeah, there's her new Consider the Lilies. That's her new, co like, companion yeah. to, yeah, okay. His Eyes yes. on the Sparrow. Yeah. And then um, I watched the video from Liz Matthews and her, mm -hmm. mom, her mom, Kathy Barrick. That was fun. I watched it. I oh, watched it on your orders last yeah, night. Yeah, I told you. Get on that stat. I did. I did. All right. Because mm -hmm. I... I was having heart palpitations. Okay, which ones were your that. favorite? Okay, I can't so remember me. the names of anything. No, but tell but, me about okay. them. You have to go watch her video. Yeah. Um, Liz had this anchor with flowers oh, on Oh, I knew that. Yes, I knew that was going to be for you. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. I have to. That stat. And then her mom had this sampler that she, it's a marking sampler. It's not a reproduction, but she did it because she wanted to use these muted colors that she likes. Um, there was that one. The, it was it really big? No, it was a small one. Of course, the big Quaker of Kathy oh, yes. Barracks. I, I love that one. Yes, and that spot the pony with the. Oh, I oh, knew that was that one. I could have picked these out for you. I knew it. I love the little pin. Well, I like the oh the pin cushion with, with the, the little the pins. Pin no, yeah. the spot the pony oh, pin yes, cushion. With the lady. Yes. Oh my gosh. And then they did the, the pony. You have to go watch the video. Okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just reveal after reveal. Yes. 
and yes. it's 40 minutes i think it's just like oh mm -hmm. and oh. they're very they were very cute and yeah a mom and daughter doing yes. that how yeah. fun and is that and they gave you all the information they did not give you thread colors they just told you whether they used npi or over right. dyed or and what fabric right what linen. fabric and, and they always do a dmc conversion yeah and they spend a lot of time doing oh, that to make sure it's right so yeah so that was good, good. so i am like on paulette's ass because <laughs> like where are the plum streets i want to see them yeah, and she usually shows hers, right? Yeah. Blackbird doesn't show theirs. No, I can't yes. wait to yes. see Blackbird. Yes. But um, I saw on Instagram, Paulette's grandson is visiting this weekend, so I don't think she's going to be. <laughs> she's not going to be like, oh, Laura, <laughs> let me get these out for you. <laughs> oh, and Kitten Stitcher and Stacy Nash. Yeah. Yeah. And coming up, I have something to show you that uh, is old, but it's coming out at market again from Tracy Riffle Hands to Work. Yeah, that's right. That's and that she has some other new things coming out that are really good. Okay. Mm. Why, well, she showed them or you just no, seen them? No, she hasn't shown them, but okay. I just know. Okay. okay. <laughs> well, people that are should be in the know are in the know, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Now, we're not doing a designer parade today. No, no we're, we're not. not. We're doing something different. We yeah, hope Brenda had a good idea. Um, what samplers have you wished you had started? I can't one? believe yes. I haven't started this yet. Okay. That's what this is called. Okay. You go first. Okay, now I have this all organized. What the heck? Oh, yeah, here it is. I can't believe I haven't started this yet. Now, Brenda said to have 10. I have more than 10. Yeah, we, we both do because... We break the rules. Yeah, we <laughs> certainly do. Okay, so we'll go back and forth, eh? Yeah. Oh. oh. I see something already that I'm like, what's that? <laughs> okay. Speaking of hands to work, and I can't believe I haven't started this. This is Ida Nolt. Oh, yeah. And this is going to be released at market. I'm going to be needing that. Yeah. Yeah, I love that. I love the colors, and yeah. that's beautiful. So I have it because it's it's an older chart, but she's re-releasing it, which is a very good idea of hers. So I can't believe I haven't started this yet because this is amazing. So hands to work, and she, um, Kitten Stitcher is taking her stuff to market for her. Oh, cool. So. Cool. Yes. I like that. You know, go do a few, and then... Okay. I just think this is so cute, Geranium House. Oh, and I want to stitch it, and I can't believe I haven't yet. That would make a nice um, spring break project. <gasps> Ooh! Mm -hmm. Leap year day spring there project. You go. Yeah. I mean, because that's relatively small. Yeah. That's very cute, Laura. Country Cottage Needleworks, mm -hmm. Geranium House. I know. A Weaver's Shuttle by Heartstring Samplery. I can't believe I haven't started yeah, it. Well, beautiful. I did start it once a long time ago when we were in Shipshawana up on the second floor. I started it, but I didn't get very far, and I want to do it. Shipshawana on the second floor. Oops. Country Sampler. Country Sampler on the second floor. Isn't that funny? You say things you think that are right, and they're not. That's why I'm here to correct you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness. Yeah. Keep going. All right. This is one I really can't believe I haven't started. I, didn't you buy the stuff for this or no? No. I think, okay. Well, okay. okay, I confess, I find the chart highly irritating. Okay. I, it's hard for me to read. It's one of her old ones that yes. are really big, yeah. I wish she yeah. would re-release this in her mm -hmm. new style. Mm -hmm. I'd buy it again. Um, oh. You know, all that back brown is stitched. I would just stitch it on a different... Autumn gold. Yeah. Um, I think Nicole started this. I don't know. I saw it recently somewhere else. Had a hernia and a heart attack. <laughs> I mean, really. It's weird, too. But, you know, I love weird things. I like the colors. I yeah. love the colors. Oh. There's a new floss tuber. Um... Live from the She Shack. And she showed her finish of this. And I had a heart attack and a hernia. 
<laughs> she had some amazing stitching and amazing yeah. finishes and starts. It was great. And this, yeah, this is right up your alley. Yeah. I mean, I, this, I, oh, I mean, I really don't even need anything from Market. I know. That's <laughs> the problem. <laughs> Nobody does, really. But, I know, but then these things come out. I know. And just... Then you have to have them. All right, I'll do one more okay. for myself now, and then we'll come okay. back to me. Okay. And I've shown this a million times, but I still can't believe I haven't started I it yet. I know. I and mean. the sheep aren't over one, I believe. I, I'm confident they're not. <laughs> yeah. That is pretty. Mm -hmm. And every time we see it, we're like, why don't I do this? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because yeah, of the model's at the attic. So yes. we have an annual pilgrimage to it. <laughs> and why we haven't even started the thing. Yes. Yes. Mm, all right. Okay. okay, now let's get some more hepped upness. Let's, this one is um, Mary Mary. And this is an older one. This is from 2015. From I got it from the attic. I got it all kitted up. Really? And I even started it. <gasps> and then I like, no, I don't like that choice that I did. So I scrapped it. Well, I don't so, think I've ever seen this one. Yeah, it's beautiful. And I've got the Attic's conversion uh, with silk. It's beautiful. Wow. I love Gigi Archer. Yeah. Then, <clears throat> this one. I mean, this is, I love a Quaker sampler. Love them. The only one I've done is that, um, oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that one over there, the 4th of July one. But I love them. And when... I first met my group of friends, my stitching friends. Pat was working on this, and she has it finished, and I believe Karen has it finished mm, as she well. Does, yeah. Why haven't I done that? This chart is amazing. These are beautiful. But don't get excited because it's out of print. But I think one no. some company bought the yes, they to did. It. But I emailed them yeah. because. And for some reason, Mary Peacock, they can't get. But oh, they okay. have other ones yes. that are. Sarah Trump, I think, is another and one. Trump. Mary Move. Mary Moon. Was, yeah, there's more than one. Hannah Gilpin, they have. Yeah. That's a good one. Here's another one. Oh, boy. The Beatrix Potter. I mean, this is a red. You could do it in a red. <gasps> oh. I, need that I think I had pulled an NPI for this. Got a hank of NPI from hmm. Dying to Stitch. I chose uh, French Vanilla from Dying from oh. R and R, and never pulled the trigger on what? it. Why not? Oh, are you insane? Yeah, that's insane. Do you think this is still gettable? I'm pretty sure it is. Okay. I'm pretty sure it is. Right. So, but if I'm wrong, I apologize. Um, Profusely, yes. I'm gonna take this out. This is a terrible picture. This was all the rage several years ago. And I had it kitted uh, with 32 count fabric. It is amazing. I would change it to 40 count. Yeah, it was done on vintage sand dune. I would do 40 count vintage sand dune. This is Anne Grant. And that picture is not very good. It is a stunning sampler. It is beautiful. And the colors are amazing. It's done with silk. Is it done with silk? Yes. I need to do this. This, if you Google Ann Grant, you'll see people that have done this. It's just a gorgeous, gorgeous sampler. I just need to follow you around and just do what you do. Yeah, right. No, seriously. These are getting me all crazy. Then this one, I've pulled this out before. This yeah. is one I don't, I am disgusted that I have not started it. Oh, I love this one. We need to start it. Yes. Stat. I mean, seriously, we could not buy anything from market and do this. Look at that. That is, what is this called? Mary Griffiths. Look at, that's that sample I have. Same name. Mary Griffiths. That is really weird. Whoa. Yeah. This that's one the, right there. Yeah. It's called Mary Griffiths. What's the year on that one? Is 1873. So is this one. 1873. What? And they're both like a Welsh sampler. I'm pretty sure this one's a Welsh sampler. Freaked out, man. But, look it's at not this. a picture. But, I keep look. meaning to call the attic for this. Yeah. This is. Ah, 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 hallelujah. 
Oh, that's amazing. Is that not just... What <sighs> linen would you do this on? I don't, I don't know. Um, do we see what's called for easily? Yeah, there? let me see. What is it called for? Beige from Weeks Dye Works. So you could use any... Um, anything, really. Yes. Anything. Any neutral sampler mm -hmm. color. Um, I don't know why these are off of here. That's but wrong. This is... Um, this is, I've had this for a couple years now. Oh, that's a disgrace. Disgrace. <laughs> I'm leaving. I know. You should. <laughs> Shameful. Oh. And then this one. Oh, and one more. Here. Stop. Just stop. This is one. I couldn't find it. I was going to bring it with. Oh. You started this. Yeah, this I know. I can't. I'm going to restart it, though. I haven't finished it for you and why I oh, haven't started it. People so. of Earth. No, Karen really. <laughs> finished. Yes, it. and Faye finished it. And if you look at both of their finishes, they're framed. They're beautiful. Okay, this and Mary Griffiths right now are what we need to be doing. But yeah, now, I mean, there's many more in here I could say that about. I mean, my heart is racing, and c for some reason I have it with. Oh yeah, because our friend Karen did it with the sampler. Uh, yeah. Threads. It calls for silks. Uh -huh. There's sampler threads, and that's what I have it kitted with. This is sampler. Is threads. that all right? Oh, absolutely. I mean, that's what I have it's, it kitted yeah, with too. Yeah, that's it. hers is beautiful. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. Yeah. I mean, we can use the silks for Mary Griffiths. Yeah, it's a I beautiful like sampler. I mean, oh, even right. all those damn alphabets. They're because they're Quakery looking. Yeah. They're, they're, Just oh beautiful. my gosh. I wish I could get this hepped up in my heart racing about doing housework or cooking or something. <laughs> nope. Okay. Esther Edison. Uh, that's in my... Okay. That's in your next subject. Next subject. You yeah, don't show it. Don't okay. show it yet. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> I love this one. Mm -hmm. And you got, you got it right off the bat. I got it right off the bat with the yeah. story behind it. Oh, what is that? Anne M. Frank's 1825 by Heartstring Samplery. I this, don't think I've ever seen that before. I showed it to you before and you really? said the same thing. <laughs> well, I didn't remember it. Still don't. <laughs> I mean, seriously, this is amazing. Oh, I gotta get that. Yeah. I should order that with um, my market stuff. I'm going to. Okay. Um, yeah. It's amazing. Um, this is another heart oh, string. Yes. yes I Victoria's Garden. I love this. Oh my gosh. And there's two different versions there, right? There's the yeah. one that's more faded. And, yes, yeah. I would do the more faded. Yeah. I like that. The, both of them are beautiful. This one really is why haven't I stitched this yet? It's called Just a Little Sampler by Carriage House. Oh, that's sweet. That's an older one, it's too. It's older, it's yeah. like on card stock, yeah. folded in half. I think oh, Pat yeah. did this one. Oh. I see it at her house. Yeah, Beautiful. I love that. Yeah. Uh, oh, really? I thought you wouldn't like this one. I love that one. And every time I see it at Country Sampler, I'm like... Why? I mean, me too. Grace Bridges Sampler by yeah. Stacey Nash. I love this. I mean, talk about weird. This is weird. In the best way. Yes. And I have the DMC ready to go. And I just, I don't know what my problem is. I love it. It's beautiful. I love that big house. Mm -hmm. The colors. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And every time I see it, I think, why the heck haven't I done that? I know. Yeah. I, think, I think it needs a big piece of linen. Yes, it does. I was just looking at that. That right. I never have. Mm -hmm. Big enough. It's on parchment by weeks, but you could use 40 mm -hmm. in the new weeks. Mm -hmm. And it would be a little bit smaller. Well, mm -hmm. could you do it on a fat quarter, or would you need more than that? Yeah, you need more than. That. All right. Well, that's what stops me. Yeah. Go. Okay. <laughs> Up next. Okay, I've got to show because I just saw this. Hold on. Hold, please. Hold, please. Yes. You could have been doing this. I know. I was watching what you're doing here. I'm just kidding. Hard I'm just kidding. Yeah. Okay. okay. So this one. Oh so man, I love that. Susanna Lynch. Mm. This is a snippet from the big sampler, and Here you look I just thing. love it. Oh, you got it ready to show? Yeah, I got okay, it ready sorry. to show. And I pulled the wools for it. Oh, wools. Because I wanted to do it with the wools. Cool. 
And then somebody, her name's Sarah on Instagram, but her Instagram name is A-S-C-A-N-I-U-S -S underscore. She took it to the next level. She finished it as a drum. I'm all over that. <laughs> I am all over that. Yeah. This is when I was talking about two projects to start today. Oh, yeah. This oh, would be one of them. Okay. I... Yeah. Love it. And I might, I have to see what size it would be for the drum, whether I would still stick with the wool mm. or do the um, sampler, do it on threads. sampler threads. Yeah. But it's just beautiful. These aren't all the colors. I didn't get all the wools. They didn't have them, but uh, this is amazing. And that was a great idea to do it as a drum. I just think that's incredible. She has, Lila Studio has a red work sampler bird thing coming out at market okay. that's really gorgeous okay i don't know if i've seen that i gotta go find that okay so let's talk about our friend tanya there's this one. Oh yeah this is one um that carol saltbox stitcher just finished last year and the picture is not as beautiful as the actual sampler. It's it's got a lot of red in there. It's all the words are not over one; they're <laughs> over two. It's simple sampler. It's pretty big, I think. Mary Cook, I love it. Why haven't I done that? Yeah, you could whip that out in a month. Yeah, right. Well, you maybe could. This is an old one of the Scarlet House, and I love it. Um, I had it kitted at one time. It's beautiful. Anne Priest, 1841, done with cottons. I love that sampler. I love the little people on it. Yeah, there's just so many little, um... That's a good one. I think I yeah. have this one, too. I love that. And Ooh. then... This one, this is from Market last year, and she has a companion to it coming out this year. This is The Perfect World. So many people finished this, and I love it. I love the black. I love the verse. It's just beautiful. This is not a reproduction. It's her own design, but I love it. And I especially love... The new one of hers coming out, Virtues. Oh no, what was it? I can't remember the names. Now. Starts with a V. I can't remember. Sorry, Tanya. But <laughs> I'm getting it. Yeah, we. Can. And it's the companion to this, and I want to start that right away. And one more. This one, a lot of people have finished. This is from the um, Country Sampler Club. The yeah, the Sampler Club. Yep. And that house, I mean, it's a red house. It's beautiful. There's the colors. Beautiful. Why haven't I done that? Okay. I haven't even opened it. Disgusting. Oh, yeah. Six Red Alphabets Needlework Press. We got this in summer school one year. Oh, yeah, several years ago. But it's out now, and mm -hmm. there's a model of it at Country Sampler. Every time I see it, I... Have a hernia yeah. and a heart attack. H and it's H. Beautiful. Yeah. And the one thing that stopped me is it's uh, long and narrow, so I'm spatially challenged as we know. So figuring out the, the fabric. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. But once you got it started, then you would enjoy it. Oh, yeah. Just going across like that. Yeah. Mm hmm. Very nice. Got? I've got this, um, which I love. Yeah. Love that. Mm -hmm. I, love it. I think Michelle Rudy did this one last year. Um, it's, and did it like in oh, yeah. record time oh, because wow. she was stressed about something and stitched it in record time. It's beautiful. This is one I really, really, really can't believe I haven't started yet. Because yeah. I love it mm -hmm. intensely. I think what stopped me is getting all the threads. <laughs> and the size. I think yeah. it's pretty substantial, mm -hmm. but it's beautiful. Yeah. DMC would be. I think I'm going to do it with DM DMC. I'm doing yeah. DMC, yeah. That's too yeah. many silks. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yep. Let's see. 
this. I should actually, I should oh. make you go get your finish of this, but it's hard to get. I know. Here. I don't know why yeah. I haven't finished this. And this probably is not, I don't know, Dames of the Needle. Yeah, that's it. Um, her name's Elizabeth. I don't know if this mm -hmm. is still, I'm not sure. I don't know if it's still available. I would check her website. Yeah. Um, love that. Um, this, Ann Thomas, Emily C. is working on this now. And, and her version is... Yeah, really amazing. There's another gal. Her name's Michelle um, Barton on Facebook. And she's almost done with it. Really? Yeah. And her, she's a monogamous stitcher. Mm -hmm. She does one thing, finishes it, goes on to the next, finishes it. I know. Wow. It's amazing. And that in itself, but this is beautiful. Yeah. You could even just do the some of the little motifs in there. Oh, yeah. And make you little know, things. pin cushions. Yeah. Yeah. And this beautiful. one, I really, this is the last one I brought. Okay. But I really can't oh, believe yeah. I even started this because I have it totally Okay, you were going to do that. You got all the, you even got Look the silks for that. Yes, I know. I put them on a ring. Yeah. Are these the ones I like? Yes. Mm. Yeah. yeah, these are the mm -hmm. um, Avera Spa. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 40 count weeks Swigert parchment. Oh, that's beautiful, Laura. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, I have it in my Heidi Crime bag. That's beautiful. Yeah, you need to start that. I do. I we're do. all hepped up. In I November. know. I know. Yeah. Okay. Here's another one from, I just saw this. This was the from the new floss tuber, the uh, live from the She, she Shack. Shack. Yeah. yeah, she finished that. She finished this. It was beautiful. And this is from Country Sampler with their version. I, I mean, this would look so great on my patriotic wall. I love it. Sampler's not forgotten. Your grand old flag. Oh, here's another one by. This is the one I can't find my chart. What? <laughs> Which has never happened to me in my whole life. Sarah Hopwood. Oh, I think I showed this last time. I love that. I just love it. With the NPIs in there. Mm -hmm. um, why haven't I done that? I don't know. This came out, um, I don't, was it last year or the year 2018. before? 2018. Oh, so two years ago. Yeah. yeah, 2018. That's. And. I was going to bring that too. <laughs> Jane Baxter. I mean, I love that. Yep. This is the country sampler version. I think, I know I showed this last time. Sorry for the repeat, but that's beautiful. Red House. Turkeys. Turkeys. <laughs> so then this morning, I have three more. I'll quickly go through. So you have to hurry up. I love this. Oh, joyous day. I love it. I love this. And these are the colors. Blackbird colors. I mean, what the heck is wrong with me? There's so many. There's too many good things. That's the problem. This Ann Peg. Another by Tanya. I love this. Didn't this Teresa is, finish this over one? Yes. Over one? Right? Over one. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. I love it. And a nice friend of ours that we met a few years ago, her name's Kathy, she sent me a piece of the 28 count that it calls for to do it over one. Um, I love it. With the cottons. And then... I love this one, This too. one. Um, a floss tuber, Lisa Abbey. Needleworks, I think, is doing this. It's so pretty. It's so sweet. This would be a great spring break project. You never, I wouldn't finish it in a week, but it's just got that feel to mm -hmm. it for me. Just a nice, fun. <sighs> and then, and then, yeah, tell me about this. So this morning, I'm innocently watching, <laughs> stitching, watching Nicole's Needleworks latest video, and she's always trouble for me. Um, because she has so much inspiration. And she was talking about Blackbird's Anniversaries of the Heart, which is all of these. I'll move over because this is a little... These are a lot. I'll go through them real quick. Huh? Yeah. It's number one. 
number two. I know you've all seen this. Our friend Katrina has had it, is finished with it, has it framing. Um, the gal Sherry from Total Framing did hers on 5260. What? Yeah. And had it finished into a tray. Oh, boy. There's a I stitch mean, along right now going on with Olivia Pumpkin Hollow Quilts and Christy's doing it too. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yes. This is Christy's morning 30 minute project, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it is. It's beautiful. I mean, why? I would do them all on one piece yeah. of fabric. Okay. Yep. And why haven't I and done personalize that? it with all family things? Yeah. I think that's where I get hung up on the personalization. I don't have a big family. And figuring out, you, you know, repeat. certain... Or you don't have to do every yeah. month. It's just... I love it. Why have I not done that? That's a heirloom piece with all the personalization. And that's the little bonus pattern on the back. You know what? This one, mm. the color stopped me because it was so muted compared to everything else. But I've seen some people changing up mm -hmm. the colors on this one. And I think I would do that. So, um, would you do it on 40 count? Yep. 40 oh. count. And I messaged Nicole. Yes. To ask her the fabric. And I think she messaged me back. I haven't looked at, um, haven't looked at it yet to see what it is. I think Katrina did hers on an R&R. &R. I'm pretty sure she did. Ooh. I mean, well. These are just beautiful. These are classic. American chestnut would be good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Old Town Blend, mm -hmm. Abyssidarian, any of them. Any of them. Hmm. Yeah. We don't need to buy a thing at market. But this is my take on it. Oh, I it's, love a good take. You have to support the designers. Oh, yeah. You have to keep them in business. So that's the way I look And at the it. linen makers and the thread makers. Correct. And if we all just st stitch from our stash, we wouldn't have new patterns coming out. So support yeah. your... So really, we're doing a kindness to the yeah. world. <laughs> it's a donation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I mean, if we didn't have this going on, ugh, there would be all hell breaking loose. I'll tell you that I, right now. Yeah, I can't imagine. Right now. I cannot imagine coming home from work and, and not what? having something creative to do. I would be a total B on wheels <laughs> more than I usually am. No, so, never. oh. Ask my husband. All right. Okay, so let's move on to... What's the next one? Okay. This one you've already shown, so I'll show this but one But what's this category, dear? Oh, I can't believe I haven't finished it. Did I get it right? <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I haven't finished this. And this one, oh, Laura Lord. showed it in her... Um, can't believe I didn't start it. it. Right, or didn't start it. Mm -hmm. And I got it when it first came out Yeah, from Country Sampler. You knew what you were doing. And I started it with the wools on 32 count. Got all the wools, decided I didn't like it, and restarted it on, I think this is 36 count. With cotton? With cotton. And this is where I'm at. Not very far. Were you a lot farther with the other? Yes. Okay. I... I don't know what my hang up is with this. I need to get back to this one because it is that's beautiful. That's a it's terrible picture, amazing. but it's a beautiful You know, sampler. there are things known as perfect samplers. That's a perfect sampler in my yeah. opinion. It has just everything about it is perfect. You know what? Another thing that we didn't talk about, this is a new release with the collaboration between Beth and Tanya of those very uh, fruit basket. Oh my gosh, I love that. That's a and I want to do it, it on two different linens and have it sewn together. <sighs> yeah, it's just a, a ma amazing idea. Yeah, love it. And it, this has fruit baskets. That's what reminded me of. So she's not crazy. Yeah. <laughs> well, I am crazy. So. Okay, let's see. I have a bag here. What's yes. in it? Yes. Let's. See. Oh, I can't believe I haven't finished Antoinette. Antonetta Bove, Bove by Linda Danielson. Samplers remembered. And here, talk about we saw this idea. Oh, from, one year <laughs> when we were in Virginia Beach, yeah. somebody had Donna. These, Donna? Mm -hmm. Donna Ray? No. Donna. Donna Wynn? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yogi Knit Girl. 
Yes. Um, she had her chart in these plastic protectors and then with these three ring binders. Oh. And so each page, I'm not going to yeah. show, but yeah. So, of yes. course, we were like, that's genius. So yes. we had to run to the office supply store and, and or and had some and we stole hers. Stole yeah. Them. Uh, she gave them to us. Yes. Okay. She kindly knew, knew that we were not so going this, to rescue this. This is a cool way to do this. Then mm -hmm. you can just, you know, bing, bong, bing. Yes. Very nice. You know, we have our things. So, and here's my big start. Yeah. I like that it goes horizontally. I know. It's pretty. so cool. Yeah. What thread are you using? What's the red I don't thing? know. I think I'm going to change uh, the fabric for one thing because it's, I uh, forgot. Oh, it's on the back of this. It's 36 cream. Oh, that's pretty. Semi-pretty. I might change to a silk. This I don't know. This looks like pomegranate. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. It's schoolhouse red. Yeah. But I don't know why I have one ruby slipper in here, too. I don't know. And I... So, it must be schoolhouse red, though, because yeah. I got more of those. Yeah. Oh, I like that, Laura. I would keep going with that. Really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, we'll see. Yeah. I have to see if I did with one or two. Okay. And all that jazz. Oh, that's right, because you never were happy with... I didn't used to be happy mm -hmm. with one strand on 36, but now I'm getting good. I like it. Good. Don't tell Deborah. Deborah's work is, she uses two strands on 36, and her work is perfect. Mm -hmm. Perfect, perfect. Oh, speaking of samplers remembered. Lucy Snooshaw. <sighs> That's in mine, too. It's a perfect sampler. Yeah, yeah. I'll pull mine out. Okay. Go ahead. You're farther. I believe. I think it's fun that we have the some of the same things. Yeah. yeah. I love this one. Um, oh, you got the top of the house started. Yeah, woo, I, the top of the house. I made mistakes in it. Some were intentional, some because yeah. I didn't read. <laughs> I've got a mistake too. But I mean, colors. But yeah. You said just keep going, so I will. I didn't do the four sided stitch. Oh and... yeah, I didn't either. Oh no, I did. This you is did. What I, did. I didn't. Yeah. Shocking. I had a four-sided stitch in something recently, and I said, no, I'm not doing it. I'm not in the mood. And there was another band that I put red instead of the blue. So. Yeah, that was my problem. I was like, oh, no. And then it's like, get a grip. Yeah, it's okay. It's all good. It's a beautiful sampler. Why the yeah. heck haven't I finished it? Yeah. yeah. Like, when we got this sampler, we should have just worked on it. Yeah. <laughs> Because we were um, took the, we were at summer school when that sampler was released, and we could have had it all done and framed before she released it to the public. Yeah, we could have been really cool. Yeah, well, that didn't happen. Mm -hmm. What else you got? This is a dot dot goose bag. Oh, that's cute. Isn't this Mary, adorable? Looks like Mary Engelbright. It does. I think that's probably why I was attracted to it. Okay, this is a GGR Elizabeth A. Wendon. I'm doing it in red. What I really love is the verse, mm -hmm. <clears throat> which I will now read aloud. Okay, pause. <laughs> little deeds of kindness, little words of love, make our earth an Eden like to heaven above. Love so that. And we have a working. That's pretty. I like the fabric. Yeah. I wonder if I wrote down what it is. Forty count something. Pretty. It looks like an iron arm, maybe. No, that's that. Okay. We'll just have to Very live pretty. without that knowledge. Oh, no. You didn't. Yeah, I did. I know we showed this when we were talking about Plum Street, but... Seriously? Wow. This... Who, who had a picture of this this week? Someone did, which reminded me of it. This yeah, is my someone we know. pitiful start. <sighs> and these are the silks. I mean, this one, I, I feel I, that you need to do with the silks. Yeah, this is beautiful. Beautiful. Why? Oh, wow. Yeah. We know, people. We know. We mm -hmm. should finish these. We know. But as Christy would say, squirrel. <laughs> Lots of squirrels. Yeah. Lots of squirrels. They're all around here. Oh, this must have been around the same time. <laughs> What's the other one? This is GGR. What is that? Little Lady in Red. Oh. Yeah. Okay. 
and I'm pretty far on her. Oh my gosh, Laura. I oh, know. I love your fabric. You do? It's yeah, the old I weeks. That. I don't care. It's those fabrics pop on there. Okay. You don't have much to go. So girlfriend. this is this will be another one. Maybe I should take home yes. and work on today because yes. it's on thirty two. It's using two strands, but it looks darn good. You only have to finish this motif over here, yeah, and then you have the same motif over there, and you're done. Really? Yeah. Oh, Maybe a little, a little bit, bit of grass. More grass. But, yeah. Oh. Yeah. That's oh. your homework. That's your marching orders. Okay. <laughs> In two weeks, we'll have it finished, folks. Okay. Yeah, seriously, I love that fabric. That's so yeah, pretty. Yeah, it's nice. The whole thing is pretty darn cool. Okay, I shall do that, I think. Oh, well, here's, um, this is cool. This is some bling for your bag. This is from Five Times Blessed. She's on Etsy. She uh, lives in the Nancy. Phoenix area, and she's at summer school for the last couple of years. She makes these cool... You can use it on your scissors, or mm -hmm. I put it as a zipper pull. I love it. So, let's see. This is an. I there was a couple people on Instagram. Ginger oh, yes. finished this, and I think Carol Crago finished this. Ginger Shawl on Instagram. Love Black this. dog sampler. There's what six colors of silk. It's beautiful. Why haven't I finished that? Jimmy. I mean, it's not very big. Could this be your marching orders? Oh, you can't no, have I marching can't. orders. I gotta finish Sarah. But is I need to get that finished. I love that. That's just so sweet. So so sweet. That's a reproduction. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ooh, that's a good one. Just beautiful. This is really um, confession time. You know. Oh, here's another one. Oh boy. This one. This is beautiful. This is stitched with that Overa Soie on that Legacy. Is Overa Soie and Soie Delger the same thing? Yes. Yep. Yep. And here is my. I mean. What happened? <laughs> I wonder what squirrel came yeah. along. Yeah. This is beautiful. 37 count, easy peasy. That's a beautiful sampler. Um, these are the silks. Beautiful. Okay. Okay. Oh, we're going old school with oh, this good. project bag. Oh. <laughs> Anus. Ooh. Well, put in know, my new, I'll put my new dot dot goose. There you go. Dot there. dot goose. Yeah. The tulip patch. Love this. I've loved it for years. And I started it. Oh, that's so pretty. But now I don't know why I don't have any of the threads in here. So. Huh. Did you start it? Oh, must have been a while ago with a two long, strands. Yes. Oh, so okay. I'm going to restart it on the 40. Okay. But that's definitely, oh, I got it in a house of stitches. Love that place. Okay, I showed this one recently. Oh, yeah. That's beautiful. But I, I mean, you know what? I was saying this to uh, Tracy Riffle. Said, this are is you gonna new be, every morning. She's like, are you going to be monogamous with something? I'm like, yes, because I intend every one I get, I'm like, I'm just going to stitch this till it's done, but I never do. Never. I love this. I'm, that's beautiful, Laura. Mm -hmm. And you're using one strand, aren't you? Yeah, because it's a 40. newer one. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, I have one more. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. It's enough of confession. This is <laughs> embarrassing. This is, and I pulled this out after watching Christy crosshatch quilts. God, I'm all red here. I think it's because I'm embarrassed. Oh, stop. It's not embarrassing. Um, Yuletide Sampler by Plum Street Samplers. I love this so much. When it was released through Shepherd's Bush at their retreat mm. several years ago, I was chomping at the bit for another year till I could get it. And I started it 
and there must have been a whole passel of squirrels outside my window. <laughs> because... <laughs> That's how they travel in passels. Yeah. This is as far as I got. I mean, oh, what? That's... I mean, what? what in the hell? Yeah. That's crazy. Holy I mean, Well, really? the good news is you can just pick it up anytime and get started. I love it. I and know. there's so many people that have finished it that I've seen on Instagram, on social media. It's all over dyed threads. I think there's one NPI or a huh. couple NPIs thrown in here. Huh. And that's awful. That is just awful. <sighs> Oh, here's another one I was going to stay monogamous with. Because this is my favorite sampler in the world. I know it's your favorite sampler yes. in the world. Yes, it is. This is the most perfect of all samplers in the entire world. Yep. Rachel Howell's Bar None. Ex yeah, Bar None. And there I am. But the good news is I can pick it up anytime. Yes. And I've got it with the NPI. So yes. I'm really cool. I really love cool. that sampler. Yeah. That and Martha Pudsey. And that's number two. But both by the Scarlet House. No question are my favorite. I got three more to show you. Okay. Do you have more? Nope. Okay. Oh, I'm done okay. with confession. All right. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, open it up like that. And all oh, things yeah. be exceedingly diligent. Or not. <laughs> yes, I am. Are you using Anchor or yeah, Dancy? Yeah, I okay. have the Anchor and yeah, that's pretty. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. It's R and R Old Town Blend in mm. a Mama Joan bag. Mm. Old Town Blend is a lovely fabric. It is very samplish. Oh my gosh, <laughs> Give me that. <laughs> well, you can. Oh, oh, I'll be useful. Martha S. Scott, eighteen seventy-six. Oh, That must have been in our dying to stitch phase there. Yes. We one. were there right around that time. So it's oh, on a 32 so with two strands. Oh, wow. Using, that's beautiful. Look, I have a darling sampling of memories thing on here and a wadded up bunch. <laughs> Let's fix this. But really, I love this. Yeah. So do you think I should start over and no. do it on 40? No, that is a beautiful sampler. I love your fabric. It's makes the co the colors pop on mm -hmm. it. Yeah, keep going. Okay. You can't finish that in a week, but yeah, that, that's a beautiful piece. You've gotten too far. Okay. All right. Okay, All right, my last one is another one that's on 32 with two strands. It's the Agnes Platt. Oh, Sampler. Um, yeah, it's amazing. It By Blackbird. Amazing. amazing. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've loved this for so long. Mm -hmm. I don't know what my deal is. Oh. Oh. Yeah. I got a good start. Yes, you do. And you did the fancy stitches, I specialty did. stitches. Yeah, in I think here? I yes. might have learned how to do them for the Smyrna's. Yep. Which now I like yeah. doing Smyrna's. I remember that. We were in um, Shipshawana. Did you teach me? Yep. Cool. Yep. Yeah. It's on uh, Lakeside Vintage Maple Sugar. Oh, that doesn't look like that to me. Yeah. That's pretty, Laura. Hmm. That's a beautiful piece. Yeah. Beautiful. Okay. Now that we're all hepped up. Oh, so what are you going to work on in the next couple weeks? I'm going to work on market. that... Lady in Red by GGR, mm -hmm. uh, and the Dutch Sampler. Oh, the Modern Folk. Yes. Okay. And I think I will just try and work on those two her, okay. her, her. Yeah. Squirrel. Yeah. What about you? Sarah Stewart Sarah Hardeman. Sarah Stewart Hardeman. I mean. And that, oh, well, it is Sunday. You've got all the afternoon. You should really yeah, do whatever well. you want. And then Sunday. there's the, the new Blackbird one. Because when oh, you go yeah. to watch Nicole's video and you see it. Really? Yeah. 
Is she yeah. using called for stuff? Yes, yeah, she's using the called for. And I have the threads and oh. the fabric. Oh, well then. Yeah. I think that's what will be happening. We're going to continue with Sarah. I'm going to be. Because if I abandon it again, I'm never well, going to You're not finish. abandoning it. It's just so. your Sunday afternoon. But will you do what This you is want. my prime stitching time okay. is the weekends. Because mm -hmm. during the week, you know, you come home from work and I'm exhausted by the time I start to stitch. So, okay. Um, Anyhow, but it's fun to have things to look forward to. So. <laughs> We've got a lot of things to look forward I know, to. I know. Okay. Well, next week, next time we do our video, it'll be market time. So I'm sure there'll be lots of sneak peeks that people will have put yeah. out there and we can talk about them. So. Yeah, we can make our lists. Yes. And we will t have a new designer next time. So. Anyhow, thanks for watching. Oh my goodness, this went long. Mm. Wish us luck on the upload. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyhow, thanks until everybody. Next time, thank you so much for all your wonderful comments. Um, yeah, we really we, appreciate them. Yes, they mean a lot to us, especially when we're having a crappy day, at least for me. At work, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> and to read those comments, it means a lot. So thank you very much. Have a good couple weeks. Okay, see you soon. Bye.